What's up, YouTube? And today I'm bringing you a video on what it means or, you know, how to style your wand in this game, which you can do a little bit. Um, now, when I say that, I don't mean just the whole one way and in total because I have another video on that. Now, I've been kind of debating on making this video just because of work and I've been sick. So I was supposed to make this video way sooner. <laughs> but here we are. Now, just to dive in right into what I'm talking about, <laughs> if we pick a wood color, or the wood, that's basically the color you want. Whatever color you want, you see I got cherry, mine. It's kind of like that reddish, brownish color right there. Let's say if I pick ebony, it's gonna change to a dark wood and I'll show you just in a second. Okay, and core, core is gonna go for gray, which is blue, blue and corn yellow, and feather, you know, red. So I'm gonna register this right now. So what I mean, I got ebony and I got phoenix feather. Now it's gonna be like a dark with a red. And that's just because I'm the Phoenix now. If I change the color, it's going to be yellow. And that's what I mean. <clears throat> now, this is where we can go into a little bit of the, you know, in depth and the customization, a little bit of the, unpick the red. Um, flexibility. Now, with flexibility, that determines your handle or the base of your wand. As you see, I got some lines right there. Now, if I go from brittle all the way to unyielded, these are going to have the same effects. So, if I register this right now, it's going to change the handle. To like a hard kind of line with this one big knot separating the handle from the actual tip of the one, and that goes all the way to unyielding, I believe. <coughs> you see, this is the same. Now, if I move one, up, that's gonna go from quite bendy. Now, quite bendy to springy is gonna have the same results as well. So, I'm gonna this one right now. Now you see I changed that base to much like I had before. It has like the two notches right there separating the tip of the one from the handle. And you see the handle has changed now to like this little bit of more of like an artsy design with the lines. And that goes all the way to springy or slightly springy right here. <laughs> see it's registered? Still the same results on that handle. Now, if I go to apply it and surprise, <laughs> surprisingly swishy. Um, that's gonna do change that base to like one notch right there separating it the tip of the one from the base and also you see the little screens at the bottom right there and that is the same as for swishy or swishy as you can see right there now those are different you know one like base styles right there which is like three from brittle to unyielding again oh and then from quite bendy to springy you know and pliant and supposedly all the same now lint there's five different lengths now if we go to nine and a half to you know ten ten and one quarter here or ten and a quarter <coughs> so I register that that's pretty much the shortest results on the one we're going to get the next height up is from ten house you see it went in two sides right there if you look at the top i go back on if you look at the top of the size of my one I'm going to re-register and right there. Now, just to go back up to 10 house. <laughs> 10 house all the way to 11, you know, quarters. So we're going to keep that same like, length. Now, from 11 house to 12 house, we're going to yield the same length. So, you see the, long, the one is getting longer. And this is just basically, you know, how the style you want, you know, as far as keeping it long. And from 12 and 3 quarters, here, oh, let me go over. 12 and 3 quarters, they increase even more. See, but now we had like the fourth lint before you get to the longest lint. That goes all the way to 13 house. See, it's the same lint. No, there was no change. Now, it goes from 13 quarters and 14 all the way up. And that's the longest lint that you'll have. So, I registered now. Let me see, I got the longest one. <coughs> And then register, it's still the same size there. So it's five different lengths um, as far as you know, as the art, where it actually changes the size of the one and, and it keeps up in those lengths. <clears throat> but that's what I mean when I say just the, the whole style of the video, or not the video, the style of the one. Um, you can just kind of make your one your own thing in this game, you know, based off the base and the size and even the color, which is, I think is pretty dope. I'm going to exit out because I don't want to say that one because <laughs> this is my favorite type right here. Not too long, but, you know, cherrywood and unicorn. But um, just to wrap up the video, I hope you enjoyed 
wasn't much, you know, going on here as far as that. Just kind of show you how to style your own one. But appreciate you much for coming by. If you liked the video, please leave a like. If you like, if you didn't like the video, leave a dislike as well. But much appreciated that you came by and stopped by and watched my video. Thank you.